We got a problem, folks. All right, friends. So I am a big user of flashlights. I use a flashlight every single day. This is one of my favorites. I have probably two or three that I use very regularly. And this one is one of my favorites. It's a little Olight. It, it's a S15 baton. And it's powered by one AA battery and it has multiple light settings. I really like it, it's a very handy light. It's nice and small, but man, I got a battery stuck inside it. The battery had a little, it looks like it's a little dented. It's hard to see there, but it got a little dent on it and now it will not come out. So we're gonna try to see if we can get it out. All right, so we are gonna try to pry it out first. I have this little small, um, flathead screwdriver and I have the blade of my utility knife. We're going to try to pry it out and see if that works. Not working so well. So the next thing we're going to try, we're going to try to drill a hole in the end of this battery then put a screw in there and try to pull it out. All right, friends, so we're gonna go ahead and we're gonna try to drill a small hole in here and then drive this screw in so we can try to pull them out. Okay, so we got our hole drilled. Now we will drive our screw in and try to pull it out. Okay, now we're gonna try to pry it out. Got it. Got the battery out. And just in time too, I think, this thing's starting to leak stuff. I'm gonna throw this whole thing away. It's getting heated up. So I'm gonna throw it somewhere cold and let it just expire. All right, so we got that battery out, but there's just a little bit of junk on here. So I'm gonna take a file around the inside and just file it just a little bit. I'm not gonna look to take off any metal. What I'm looking to take off is any of the junk that is still inside there. I once had a battery corrode in here and it was really tough to get out. I finally got it out, but it left some residue in there. And so I'm gonna file this just a little bit inside there, not going all the way down. I don't want to hit the bottom of it, but I just wanna get off anything that could stop a battery from sliding really easy. And then I'm gonna check it and make sure the thing works. Okay, we're gonna try the, oh, it slides in there just fine. Moment of truth, folks. Hey, all right, back in action, all right. I really like this little Olight. One thing I really like about it, it has a magnetic base, so you can actually stick it to things. Like if you're working under a car, you can stick it to the car hood or whatnot. Or if you're working on a piece of equipment, and it'll stay right there. I really enjoy this little Olight. It has a lot of lumens, a lot of light for such a small little package. And man, it's a fighter. It has been a long time that I've had this. It just keeps going. So thanks Olight for making a good product. And folks, if you ever get a battery stuck, now you know how to fix it.